Rows and rows of storage units house everything from priceless treasures to miscellaneous rubbish. Patricia Taylor's unit holds dozens of boxes as she's preparing to sell her home. But it's not as full as it used to be. A few weeks ago, she got an alarming call. Her unit had been broken into. The public storage people called us, but I didn't know exactly what was missing. Until December 5th, when someone emailed Taylor's sister. And said, I have these things that belong to your father. And it's clear to me that these were not things your family would want to sell. And she had um, some of my father's um, uh, training manu things from when he was taking courses as a, a young uh, officer. Taylor's father, Lieutenant Colonel Robert Roy Taylor, retired from the Navy after serving in World War II, the Korean War, Vietnam, and during the Cold War. Lieutenant Colonel Taylor died in 2011, and his daughter flew his things to her home in Austin. The woman who bought the stolen heirlooms purchased them at Antique Marketplace on Burnett Road. Taylor, her sister, and Austin police detectives went to the store and recovered two of Taylor's footlockers filled with various things, but some of his stuff is still missing. My father had like almost uh, two dozen uh, medals and they were in a frame and they're gone. We don't know where they are. These missing mementos, historical in the public eye, represent so much more to Taylor and her siblings, pieces of their father who spent his entire life serving his country only to have the rewards of his work stolen. I could cry right now. I mean, it. It, 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 the coldness of this theft, to recognize what these things meant and yet to steal them, that, that just floors me.